So, I mean, it was, and to be the only woman in the room amongst people that are that established, like it's yeah. scary. It's very intimidating, it's very scary. Um, but there's also a basic comfortability mm. because when I look around and I'm sitting in, in, at this table with people who are so established, I have to remind myself like, okay, you're not there yet, but you're here now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, look at where you're at now. Right. Like, you know what I mean? Like you gotta kind of have a little bit of pride on that because you, for me, especially being an athlete or even with my background, like I came from a single mom, like we didn't have yeah. zero. Like I've always had to kind of continue to put myself in positions where survival was, like you're gonna figure it out yeah. no matter yeah. what. You yeah. know, you don't yeah. know the word can't. Like my mom always told me, you don't know the word can't. Don't ever look, let anybody tell you the definition of what that means because you don't know it. Yeah. Like stay blank to it. And that I kind of grew up with, just, and continuously kept putting in every perspective, whether it was with pageants I did, or with going putting myself to general school, or becoming a professional athlete to even the entrepreneurial world. Was look, you know, it took a lot of work for you to get here. Now you're either gonna like, and it could take one small instance to completely take it away from you. And that is a scary feeling, but for me, I have to recognize where I'm currently sitting. And even though, like I said, the whole base of vulnerability, I am genuinely proud of myself. Yeah. Like, it, I have to constantly say that because being able to establish myself and, and to be in a place of where I feel inferior and that I have all these base of emotions, the one thing that's gonna over, that keep me going and that's gonna completely just shadow all that out is me being like my pride and then saying, you know what, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna fail at this, man. You put yourself here. Look at, look at, like you said, look, look back and look at everything that you've been able to do to get to this point. Now you can either take those steps back and be okay with what you did, or you can keep going, look back again and be like, dang, year later, we're still going and look how much further we've got. Mm.